Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. It has been nine days, I think, since my last video. I am consistently consistent. I'm trying to get better at it, but I've lacked all motivation for the last week. Um, so instead, I decided to get motivated and try to organize some of this witchy room stuff. I have four of these storage bins, only three fit on the shelf. I've already did one, and now I'm just, there's just, things have just been dropped, stuffed, thrown in, and it just, it doesn't work for me anymore. I want things tidy and easy to get to. So I've been doing it in my bedroom and in my kitchen and my linen closet. And I have just been in a de decluttering and organizing mood. Um, Clutterbug here on YouTube. Her videos are fantastic for helping you figure out where to start, what to do, how to do it. I love her. I've, I've actually went into a rabbit hole of Clutterbug videos and figured it can work in the witchy room too. Now, for the most part, things are organized. My cabinet's organized. My desk is mostly organized. The white cabinet, less organized, but still know what's in there. Um, the herbs, I try to keep them alphabetized, but that, that, that first I tried keeping them alphabetized. Then I tried keeping them by type. I like root, flat, with that didn't work. Now they're just, as long as all the big jars are together and all the little jars are together, I'm happy. Um... But, like, there was a piece of, oh, see this gorgeous fabric that goes in here. There was some, I had a silver glitter ribbon. And the glitter, how it's still losing glitter, I don't know. But now everything is covered in glitter. So that ribbon's going. Um, I've got a pile of fabric here that I'm going to give to my sister. Maybe my niece can use it for their cosplay stuff. If not, if she looks at it and says she can't use it. I'm putting it in a box with the other stuff going to Goodwill, and it's out of here. Um, do you guys struggle with the same thing? Because this is... Oh, Schwinn bag. I have now found... This is the third. It is fantastic ivory... Like a muslin-type fabric. Great for making poppets and charm bags, because it's a nice neutral color. Just don't know where they came from. But I'll use them. You know, tons and tons of sachet bags. I have a bag of them over there. Um, extra w ribbon from my wedding. Ribbon I bought for my grimoire project that I haven't done yet. More ribbon from my wedding. So, oh, felt. Felt goes with the fabric. It's just been, it's a lot. And I have notes from a video I made four months ago. <laughs> That's funny. I don't know how that ended up in there. Um, I have some ideas. Like I signed up for some classes on Udemy.com about three years ago. One was the Reiki. The other one was, I think there's a tarot one I signed up for, and I think I signed up for an herbal one, because they were, like, having a end-of-the-year or beginning-of-the-year sale, and it was, like, $3.99 a class or something. I signed up. I don't think they were that cheap, but I signed up. I did Reiki Level 1, and then put it out. So I was thinking that I would finish the classes, and when I finish each class, review it for you guys. If that's something you're interested in, let me know down below, because that'll spur me on to get it done and keep me motivated to actually do the things I say I want to do. Um, still reading Weave the Liminal. I hope to have that finished by the weekend so that I can do a video for you for, for that as a review. Oh, I do like it though. It's, it's very good. Um, it might be one of my new favorite witchy books. So I think it's, yeah, it's really good. Um, but this was bugging me because I have, I have the extra bin and it's just getting moved from spot to spot to spot. You know, kind of like you have that pile of clothes 
it's on it's on the bed, but then you want to go to bed, so you move it to the chair, and then in the morning you need the chair to get ready for what for your day. So now you move it back to the bed. That's what this bin has been. So if I can get the one bin empty, I can get it out of here, and I can use it for something else, somewhere else in the house. Another Schwinn bag. Um, but that's about it. I haven't. I just haven't had any motivation lately, and I know you all can relate. We all get that way every now and then. Um, starting to snap out of it now. So, and now that my schedule has kind of become more consistent again because my son's winter break is over, he doesn't drive yet, so I drive him back and forth to school. Um, he's a sophomore in college now, and he's he'll be driving eventually, but he didn't feel ready, so there's no need to rush. And now that his schedule is kind of is set, my schedule can be set and I get more consistent as we move along. But one thing about me, I'm usually fairly inconsistent or I procrastinate a lot. Um, doesn't make me a bad person. Just means things aren't always going to get done when I want to get them done. I've learned not to say out loud when I want to do something because... It's not going to get done, and then I feel bad. So I don't do that to myself anymore. But I will have the book read, because I'm really loving that book. Um, and that's about it. If you have, if there's anything you'd like me to make a video on, again, let me know down below or shoot me a message. There's a link to my Instagram and my Facebook, both in the About Me section. Um... I'd love to hear it. I'd love some great ideas. I have a list of ideas. They're upstairs next to my couch. I'm downstairs in the basement. It's actually kind of chilly down here, even with the heater on, because it's been very cold here in Connecticut. Um, that's about all I have for today, which is really not much. I think I just kind of rambled about a bunch of nothing. Um, but I did get a bin almost emptied. Um, Counted cross. This was my mother. This can go. Um, is this another. Oh, well, this one hasn't been started yet, so I can use the fabric. Okay, see? More poppet fabric. They're just. It's just. It's... Another sachet bag. More spools of ribbon. Ooh, that's pretty. Pretty silver ribbon. I just have so much. I always, every, oh, I could use that for. And then I put it in a bin or a jar or a box or a bag. And then it just, and then I don't use it. And then when I want to make the thing that I said I'd saved this for, I can't find this, so I buy a new one. So if I get it organized better, I can, well, I haven't been buying anything. If I don't have it in here, as far as witchcraft goes, or if I don't have it in, I don't need it. If I don't already have it, that means I don't need it, because I would have already bought it. Ooh, that's a pretty blue. So, how do you organize your stuff? I mean, my, my witchy cabinet is very organized. My herbs, incredibly organized. My books, my desk, Eh. my craft cabinet we don't speak of that inside the altar I mean I think it's I don't know yeah, it's pretty organized in there <laughs> um, oh this smells good in there but that's that's about it I'm just organizing I figured I would chat a little bit while I did some of it I'm pretty sure you don't want you know a, three hour video of me organizing the witchy room because that would get boring I mean I'll talk all day I got I could talk about all kinds of things I'm a chatterbox but no nothing nothing witchy is a, has happened nothing exciting has happened I haven't done a whole lot just cleaning out closets and dressers and trying to get things tidy in this house and get rid of all the extra stuff um I guess that's it. Thank you for listening to me ramble. If you're still here, 
I'm so glad you stuck around because I don't know if I would have stuck around for me. Um, thank you for watching this video. I hope to see you in the next one. Um, cheers with iced tea. And I will see you again soon. Bye.